Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice algebra equation. K squared is equal to h times i. We need to find all possible values of k. So let's start. First of all, we suppose that let k is equal to a plus b i. Then this equation will become a plus b i whole squared is equal to 8 i. Now, by using this uh, algebraic identity a plus b whole squared is equal to a squared plus uh, b squared plus 2 a b. This uh, a plus b i whole squared will become a squared plus uh, b times i whole squared plus uh, 2 times a times b i is equal to 8 i. Next, a squared plus uh, this uh, b i whole squared will become b squared times i squared plus uh, 2 a b i is equal to 8 i. Next, a squared plus b squared times this i squared i squared is equal to negative 1. So, we replace this i squared with negative 1 plus 2 a b i is equal to 8 i. Next, a squared plus b squared times negative 1 negative b squared plus this 2 a b i is equal to this 8 i can be written as 0 plus 8 i. Now, we write this real part a squared minus b squared equal to this real part 0 we write this uh, imaginary part 2abi uh, equal to this uh, imaginary part 8i like this uh, a squared minus b squared is equal to 0 and 2abi uh, is equal to 8i. Now, from this equation to find the value of b, we divide uh, both sides of this equation by 2 a i. At right hand side we divide by 2 a i. So, this 2 a will be cancelled out with this 2 a and this i will be cancelled out with this i. And from the right hand side this i will be cancelled out with this i and 2 4 times 8. So, here we are left with b is equal to 4 over a. Now, in this equation, we replace this b with this uh, 4 over a. Then, this equation will become a squared minus value of b is 4 over a. This square will come here is equal to 0. Next, a squared minus 4 squared is uh, 16 divided by a squared is equal to 0. And from this a squared, we can write the denominator 1. We take LCM. LCM of 1 and a squared is a squared. And a squared divided by 1 is a squared. a squared times uh, this uh, numerator a squared a to the power 4 minus a squared divided by a squared is 1. 1 times this 16, 16 is equal to 0. Now, from here we multiply both sides of this equation by a squared. So, this a squared will be cancelled over with this a squared and here we are left with a to the power 4 minus 16 is equal to 0 times a squared 0. Now, this a to the power 4 can be written as a squared whole squared minus this is 16 can be written as 4 squared 
is equal to 0. Now, by using this uh, algebraic identity a squared minus b squared is equal to a minus b times a plus b. This uh, a squared whole squared minus 4 squared will become a squared minus 4 times a squared plus 4 is equal to 0. Now, from here either this expression a squared minus 4 is equal to 0 or this expression a squared plus 4 is equal to 0. From this equation we move this uh, negative 4 to the right hand side then a squared will be equal to 4. And if we take a square root of both sides then this implies that uh, a is equal to plus or minus 2. Now, from this equation we move this uh, plus 4 to the right hand side then a squared is equal to negative 4. And if we take a square root of both sides then this implies that a is equal to plus or minus square root of negative 4. Next a is equal to plus or minus this uh, square root of negative 4 can be written as uh, square root of 4 times square root of negative 1. Next, a is equal to plus or minus square root of 4 is 2 and uh, square root of uh, negative 1 is i. Now, a is equal to plus minus 2 and a is equal to plus minus 2i. To find the values of b, Recall that recall that B is equal to 4 over A. Recall that B is equal to 4 over A. Recall that B is equal to 4 over A. First, in this equation, we put this value of A plus minus 2. Then B will be equal to 4 divided by plus minus 2 and b is equal to 4 divided by plus minus 2 is plus minus 2. So, from here we get a comma b is equal to value of a is plus minus 2 comma value of b is plus minus 2. Now, in this equation we put this value of a plus minus 2i then this will become b is equal to 4 divided by plus minus 2 i. Next, b is equal to 4 divided by plus minus 2 i will become plus minus 2 divided by i. Now, from here we multiply and divide this expression by i. So, b is equal to plus minus 2 times i plus minus 2 i divided by this i times this i will become i squared. This is equal to plus minus 2 i divided by this i squared is equal to negative 1. This is equal to plus minus 2 i divided by negative 1 will become negative plus 2 i. So, from here we get another pair when a is equal to 2 i plus minus 2 i then b will be equal to minus plus 2 i. Now, to find the value of k recall that recall that k is equal to a plus b i. Recall that k is equal to a plus b i. So, when a is equal to plus minus 2 and b is equal to plus minus 2, then k will be equal to in place of this a we write plus minus 2 plus in place of this b we write this 
plus minus 2 times this i. Next, k is equal to plus minus 2 plus this plus minus 2 times i. This is the first value of k, this is the first solution of this equation. Now, when a is equal to plus minus 2i and b is equal to negative plus 2i, then k will be equal to place of this a, we write this plus minus 2i plus in place of this b, we write negative plus 2i times this i. Next, k is equal to plus minus 2i and the negative plus 2 times this i times this i will become i squared. Next, k is equal to plus minus 2i negative plus 2 times this i squared is equal to negative 1. Next, k is equal to plus minus 2 i and this the minus plus 2 times negative 1 will become plus minus 2 and this can be written as k is equal to plus minus 2 and plus minus 2 i. This is the second value of k, this is the second solution of this equation.